I think one of the most confusing things in, when you talk about fly rods is the difference between a rod's action and a rod's power or stiffness. In fact, I've been in fly shops where the terms rod action, fast action, and stiffness, it gets all kind of mixed up. I'm going to tell you what I think the difference between rod action and rod power are. On the deflection board here, if you look at the shape of the rod when you hang a weight from it, if I hung a weight and the bottom of the rod was very stiff and the top of the rod was soft, the shape that this curve makes is what we would call a fast action fly rod. If I put a different rod up here and I hung a weight from it, it boy, it really wanted to bend down near the bottom of the rod, but the tip was a little stiffer. This shape kind of indicates that the rod has a slow action. In the case of this nine foot number five Echo Classic rod, well, the tip's kind of bends a little bit, it progresses to stiffer. This is what we call medium fast action. This shape, this action, covers, I think, the largest range of conditions. So the action is what the shape of the curve of the rod is when you hang a load from it. Now, power is a different story. Power is the overall stiffness of a fly rod. So with hanging four or five ounces on the end of this fly rod, if I hang it and it bends down in comfortable level, this might be a number five rod. If I hung a, another rod up here with the same amount of weight, it was way up here, <clears throat> boy, that might be a number seven or a number eight rod. So to wrap things up in very simple terms, rod action is where the rod bends, the shape of the curve of the rod with a given load. Rod power or rod stiffness is simply how much and how far this thing bends under a given load. Action and power, two different things.